all right hi collective welcome welcome back to my channel welcome to subscribers so today this is another collective reading as usual it's very weird like every single time i'm about to record or do something like this damn lawnmower guy want to be outside it's really annoying but it happens every single time i'm about to record a video so i might be like screaming the whole entire time or i don't know but i just know i need to channel this reading right now so basically, sorry for the weird introduction, but somebody may not want you to know something or someone could just be doing too much. As in, they're just like doing the most. As in, slang term of doing, I'm about to say doing extras. I don't know, if you don't know what that means, then I don't know if you shouldn't be here on my channel. Um, I, I mean, I'm young, I talk in slang, like it, it's just, it is what it is. Someone is doing more than they should be doing. Yeah, I'm so glad the guy is gone. So, basically the channel message here today is there's somebody who knows that somebody is either getting entangled or feel some kind of way because they know that you know your worth or they know that you know that you are the prize so there's somebody near you who could be um intimidated yeah there's somebody intimidated by the fact that you know your worth So, you could have recently cut somebody off completely. You could have um, put up extra boundaries with people around you or someone here. This is either the person you did this with, these boundaries, or whatever this is here, okay? I'm not saying you could be talking to a friend or you could be talking to someone about something. And if it's not a friend, this is... Um, you're going to get direct confirmation about, like, who this is that feel some kind of way it's like okay so it's like you most recently could have done something that made you the empress that hires your standards that's what i was kind of getting to actually that is what i'm getting and somebody who has low standards doesn't know how to do what you do okay the empress card so you may actually be learning from your mistakes or it, mistakes that you have made in the past <clears throat> where's the Florida water so yeah there's something that you did that like heightened your standards or you could be hiring your standards here or somebody sees you this way and someone feels some kind of way about it because they don't know how to be like you or they don't know how to like it's like somebody wants to learn from you but maybe someone's too scared to or i'm yeah i mean like yeah someone's intimidated so yeah collective you know how to like heighten your standards or you know how to cut somebody off you know how to put a boundary up okay and this is like making someone near you feel very insecure so it's i've, I've done a, yeah the ace source this is the truth i've done a reading about this before about like um you may accidentally make people feel insecure yeah the five of swords five of swords four of swords so something is um someone's hiddenly hating hiddenly hating so covertly but something is going to come out overtly that's the spirit to say but yeah so um yeah you could be definitely you could definitely know yourself worth here or know what's best for you or know that um so someone knows also that you're not easy if you were like thinking someone thinks you're easy they don't they think you're like the hardest challenge ever the devil which is making someone obsessed but the empress card here i definitely feel like you've made a high vibrational move or decision i'm also mean like someone is like waiting to see like what you do next the devil card what's the collective's energy so yeah so okay so basically again you're high you're hiring your standards what does this mean knowing your worth 
um, knowing what to let go of, knowing what to stand by. I'm also getting, um, we have, I, I was definitely getting like forgiveness or letting something go. I'm also getting like, yeah, femininity. Okay, so there's something about you using um, dark femininity and light femininity in the situation. I'm also getting, yeah, someone's uncomfortable by the fact that you know how to be in your feminine energy, that you know how to ask a masculine for help and you don't have to do everything yourself. Okay, I'm definitely getting, or if you're a male here, you know when to go to a woman for something. Okay, I'm definitely getting like, you could be an independent person here but like you may have a balance with that shit like you may know like it is okay sometimes to ask for help it is okay to get guidance you don't have to do all that shit alone that's how you end up miserable okay so yeah so i'm not thinking like someone could feel like offended by this or just some kind of way so we have doing too much more than they should so yeah so maybe someone feels like they're doing too much for you Okay, maybe um, I'm also getting like offended. Someone could feel offended about something you said or did. I'm also getting like you are the pride. So you could just be prioritizing yourself currently, prioritizing your self worth. I'm also getting like getting money. Okay, I'm also getting like gold diggers. Someone could be calling you this. Yeah, we have the nine of wands. Okay, yeah, I was definitely getting that in the last video. All right, so because you know, okay, so I'm not thinking you could have curved someone, dropped someone, let someone go. Now someone's like, oh, well, you ain't shit. Or, damn, or someone's saying like, you know when someone gets rejected and they get all in their feelings, they get all boohoo hurt. Uh, girls, if you ever rejected a guy and they say some like disrespectful ass shit, like, yeah, that's exactly why I curved your ass. Okay, it's like, yeah, but I'm definitely getting you are the prize. But that's in a lower vibrational sense. I'm also getting someone looks at you as a goddess. Yeah, we have the high priestess. I must mean don't outshine the master. Okay, this could be in a work environment. Yeah, intimidated because you know your worth. So, um, okay, or this could be a lover. Maybe someone is intimidated by the fact that you know your worth or this is others around you, okay? If you're not in a relationship or if you're not doing anything like that, this is just simply like hiring the standards for yourself, taking yourself out, doing those those beautiful things for yourself, buying yourself flowers, um, you know, taking time out to yourself yeah someone may think that like if you're by you're lonely doing this it's weird you're odd but the whole time you know yourself were what's the um energy for the collective yeah exactly the empress so yeah maturity the um also yeah also the empress card represents uh, again like high vibrations like just I mean, the, the Empress card to me is a high, is one of the, is the most high vibrational card there is. I'm also getting like exactly this is something about your femininity, okay? Attractiveness, Ace of Wands. I'm also getting like a lot of men are attracted to you. We have the Ace of Wands and we have the King of Wands. I'm also getting like there's somebody who's like realizing this or this is like someone realizing they have a dime. I'm also getting like someone. Yeah, the Death card. We have Taurus, Scorpio. Yeah, and we have Earth sign. We have Capricorn energy here. So I'm definitely getting here like someone's realizing that they cannot lose you or I don't know, someone likes a challenge or you could be giving uh, multiple people a challenge here. But I'm definitely getting like you're coming off very attractive. I'm also getting like asserting something in a dominant but feminine way. Again, this is about your femininity. So um, yeah, I'm also getting like um, there's somebody like who's like a pick me meaning like they'll do like they'll do anything and everything to like get a male to like them or um, a male can be a pick me for women too usually they if they do that that means that they've had deranged relationships with the mother or father so with the king of wands to the ace of bones here i'm just definitely getting a, you have a lot of suitors or you have a lot of men that want to be with you the empress or you have multiple people wanted like attracted to you want to take you out ace of wands okay so some of you guys could be single here others of you guys this could be i'm just gonna put all these upright others of you guys this could be like a um a fire sign i'm definitely getting this fire sign male okay it's almost like someone is like blowing like a bag on you okay or somebody is like if it, it feels like i almost getting like somebody wants to like um wine and dine like i mean like somebody is giving you love 
luxury things, okay? Because you're the empress. Okay, so I'm definitely getting there's other people who like wish that they could have that, or wish they could they they could, they could be able to um, get what you have. Okay, this could also be you whining and dining yourself. Not everybody here is in a relationship. You could be whining and dining yourself. You could just be just doing really nice things for yourself. Like again, you could also be um, you could be getting your hair done here, hair done, nails done, everything. Big. That's an empress card to me, right? Um, so I'm definitely getting like real beautiful. I'm just getting like very like um, voluptuous. Or you could be like getting like like thick. Like you're getting like super like voluptuous. But like it's it's beautiful. I'm, I'm getting like uh, I'm, getting, I'm getting like someone's curvy or this could be also like slim thick. Like okay, yeah. So yeah, I'm definitely getting like real beautiful energy here. And because of this, I'm also getting like, but also like. It's also your vibration too. I'm definitely getting your vibration is definitely hype me because you're standing in your standards. I'm also getting like you're not going to lower your standards or compromise and shit. Like you want what you want, and that is just that. Okay. And if somebody doesn't like that, if someone can't fit that, they can go. The door is right there. Like I'm also getting like, yeah, we have the high priestess. So yeah, I feel like you're trusting yourself. I feel like here that like you're just like okay like it is what it is like you know so the empress yeah so okay so this ace of wands this king of wands you definitely have a lot of people who want to have sex with you or again want to take you out you could just be going on multiple dates going out to eat I'm also getting like steak 48 I'm getting like um very nice restaurants here I'm also getting like um yeah someone's definitely like taking you out somewhere nice okay i'm also getting like casual something casual here too all right so you don't have to overdress for something if you're going out on a date or doing something okay yeah so we have the six of cups all right so someone from your past see someone from your past a leo is being like held back yeah someone is sad because or someone's upset someone's in their feelings because of the six of cups because they can't return back or uh, it's almost like somebody wants the old you back i'm also getting like um i'm hearing like you could have like gotten like a money upgrade or I'm, I'm or this could just be like your life got more luxurious or you start making more money and shit just changes all right the ace of cups i'm just getting like you're entering the ultimate self-love yeah i'm also getting like you don't care who leaves like you don't care you someone has to meet your standards that's just it is what it is okay i must get someone could be seeing that come on someone could be thinking that you're stubborn all right but again someone likes the challenge all right so we have the um what is this the judgment no this is the moon all right so yeah femininity yeah the king of um the knight of wands and the five of wands all right so again so you have this fire sign or this leo or it's like someone is like hella conflicted about something all right we have the ace of wands let's see what else is going on all right the queen of pinnacles so yeah all right so taurus Virgo, capricorn this could be your sign this could be your place yeah, the Ace of Wands. I'm definitely getting here. Um, yeah, again, you're coming off very attractive. Six of Pentacles. Not only that, I feel like you're extremely caring, kind. I also feel like, um, yeah, the Magician. Yeah, the High Priestess. Yeah, you guys have very powerful energy. Pisces, Aries energy is here. Yeah, Temperance. Okay, Sagittarius energy is here. I'm also getting like you're also very kind to others. All right, so I'm definitely getting like you have someone really observing you more than you think. I feel like you're very kind to just anybody and everybody. I feel like you, you give people the utmost respect. But when they disrespect you, you just leave. Yeah, the, the title or you ghost or you don't say anything. Or, yeah, the seven of wands. If something is a challenge, yeah, the will of fortune to the fire sign. Yeah, the hermit. So I feel like here that like, someone is like in discernment thinking about you. Yeah, we have that someone wants to communicate something here. The ten of cups. Okay, but I'm hearing the holy grail. I'm also getting like you're going to be really happy about something. The Ten of Cups. Yeah, the Sun. All right, so yeah. I'm also getting like, um, yeah, this is something. Yeah, Six of Wands. This is something about forgiveness. You made the right decision here. Okay, even if um, there's people judging you for something. Okay, um, not everybody needs to know your business. Yeah, we have the Four of Wands. That's for some of you guys here. You may also be forgiving your family members or forgiving a mother here or um, forgiving this water sign for forgiving um, this fire sign. You may, yeah, I feel like, yeah, the two of pentacles. I feel like you guys have a very excellent balance with your energy here. I'm also getting like, you don't hold grudges. I'm also getting like, don't get, 
don't ever get advice from someone that you would never look up to okay i'm also getting like um yeah i'm also getting like there's a whole bunch of people who look up to you too yeah we have the full card so you're taking this new leap of faith three of cups i see you celebrating having the time for a pent all right the eight of pentacles okay not only that i feel like you're working very hard you're very self-sufficient i feel like things want to be given to you because you're in your north node or you're in the energy for yourself okay or you're like it's like you're really like accomplishing the things you're supposed to be accomplishing understanding your lessons okay or you will be okay all right let's switch the deck for y'all let's go ahead and see what else is going on y'all's energy is the empress Honestly, like someone may think that they know you or maybe you make people feel very comfortable too with this energy here. All right, so what else is going on? Thank you. All right, so you're going to get direct confirmation or communication about something here. I feel like here someone's only, so if someone is ignoring you or what's going on, the magician, yeah, someone wants to try to play mind games be manipulative knight of wands i feel like someone's extremely sexual six of cups some of your past all right so we have the full card i'm also getting here like someone cannot stop like thinking of you like you're running through someone's mind every single day we have the magician and we have the hierophant so you're gonna receive confirmation okay um or you're gonna receive communication from this taurus this aries here let's see what else is going on yeah there's some form of good news coming in what else to know? Let me get some water. I'm also gonna, you have a, um, a hater around you too. That's what Spirit was saying. Because like somebody doesn't really know how to be in this energy or maybe somebody hasn't reached this level of enlightenment, this level of, I'm mean, being femininity. Like I'm getting something that's like about, or something is about divine feminine energy, like true divine feminine energy. Okay, and, and not and when I say femininity, that doesn't mean like oh you let people walk over you, oh you don't stand up for yourself because women can stand up for themselves. But it's just more so like it's the way you go about it. It's very like regal and poised and just proper. I'm even getting here. Okay, so let's see what else is going on. I'm also getting, um, there's a lot of money coming to you or someone is supplying you with uh, money or, you know, let's keep hearing well kept. All right. So yeah, exactly. We have the nine of cups and we have the seven of pentacles. All right. So you end up getting what you want, the seven of pentacles, even though you had to like cut off people, dodge people, leave people out. You end up getting, yeah, yeah. The eight of cups, you end up getting what you want, the king of pentacles. So yeah, um, with this kind of energy you're in, you should probably be with a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn or king of pinnacles someone who has their shit together someone who has their money together and someone who's stable someone who i don't know if you should be with a water sign or something or make sure like whoever you're with has like earth dominant in them because that's how that you, yeah so some of you guys are gonna realize you're meant to be with an earth sign or you may check your seventh house or something it could be an earth sign towards world capricorn um yeah you're meant to be yeah that's that means you're rising okay um looking at your rising sign yeah, like with this kind of energy, I feel like maybe you have just met people who just cannot handle this. Yeah, the Ten of Cups and you're glad to leave. Yeah. All right. Like, yeah, but I'm definitely getting um. there's somebody who definitely um. there's somebody that you may be forgiving or that you have forgiven or for something. And they're, I'm getting like they're one of the only people who are able to handle your energy or handle this Empress like energy or be okay with um your spirituality yeah something could also be about spirituality as well i feel like someone does match your energy who is this or this is yeah the six of pentacles i feel like this is someone who's extremely giving yeah the magician but i also feel like someone's a manipulator yeah all right so we have this the seven of swords the five of wands i also feel like someone cannot lie to you or like it doesn't work if somebody wants to do this let's see yeah i don't know maybe this person is has a big ego all right yeah, especially if someone is well established. So yeah, you need to be attracting like men, women who are established themselves, have their own shit going on, maybe even have their own businesses, have their own plans, like so yeah, people on your level. Alright, so yeah, the magician, the six of wands. So this person here, 
Yeah, I also feel like someone is in the occult just like you. I feel like someone does match your energy spiritually, but someone's still learning something. Okay. All right, Collective, that's all I have for you guys today. Thank you so much for being here, and you guys stay blessed. Bye.